What follows is an unadulterated, unfiltered, real interview with my favorite Wuhan local and my Chinese teacher going on about six months. Mm. All right. Okay, ready? Okay. 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 Have been on the I'm talking to the audience. Okay. If you're watching this video, you've been on the internet lately. And if you've been on the internet lately, you know that the people of parts of China are undergoing a very difficult time. Not unlike my good friend here and teacher and mentor who I shall leave anonymous as I do myself on these videos. Teacher, good to see you again. Yes. <laughs> I want to ask you a few questions about the current situation in your hometown. I know it's your favorite mm -hmm. city in China, and it sounds like one of the more exciting, vibrant places there. It sounds like Chicago in the United States. Can you tell me right now with the coronavirus and everything that's happening, uh, what information you've gotten as to where this came from? Uh, up to now... There is no anyone that I know has been infected by the virus. Mm -hmm. We have been staying at home for the past 20 days, more than 20 days. And uh, we see the number of the cases goes up every day. We are very worried about that. And uh, mm. What kinds of things have you done that may be a little bit different than your regular life since the city has changed and has had some, sort of a lockdown? The biggest difference is that we cannot go out. We can only stay at home. And sure. uh, uh, my work is, is at home, so it has no much difference to me. But for the people who work in the office, um, Wuhan, uh, people who live in Wuhan, their uh, day to restart work has postponed. Mm -hmm. So being inside all the time can sometimes have a strange effect on people. Have you noticed yourself ever sticking your head out the window or opening the window or actually just going outside briefly just to do it so you don't go crazy? Um. Uh, a few days before, we thought it's it was not so dangerous to go out, but for the past two days, we've known that there are a few cases in our community, so we are afraid that is it will be very dangerous if we go out. Hmm. So maybe in the last few days, you've said, "I can't go outside at all." Right. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I can't all go out. Yeah. At all. Do you worry or is there a concern about the food supply? If people can't go out, getting food no. must be pretty difficult, right? No, for every community, there are a few people or an organization or a committee are responsible for the food in a certain community. So we don't worry about the food supply. We can also go out, but it's I'm just a little afraid to go out. But yeah. many people, they are not afraid. Yeah. So they just go out when when they want. Right. Well, I'm afraid, too. I don't want you to get sick. <laughs> so I just stay at home. Right. And It's very boring. <laughs> well, hopefully some of my comical mistakes in Chinese will help you not be so bored. So what is something that you think you've started doing or you've learned since this whole thing, since the coronavirus started, maybe a practice that you've started that makes you happier or makes you feel like you're living a little bit better that you didn't do before that maybe other people can learn from? Actually, I, I'm a little boring because of my work. I've been busy with my work for yeah. since February, but I can see in my WeChat moments, there are many friends. They yeah. try to find things to play with at uh -huh. their home. Yeah. Most of them have children, and yeah. the children are eager to go out, but they cannot. 
Yeah. So they created many different ways to play at home. Wow. Okay. I can only imagine that. I didn't think about that, but that must be really. I can difficult. only imagine. <laughs> yeah. Good thing it's a good time to not have any children during the coronavirus. <laughs> yes. Maybe one day, but maybe at a later time, right? Okay.、Mm-hmm. Is there anything else you want to share with people who might be curious about this and might feel like they want to do something or they want to help or they they just want to know?、Mm, I'm expecting people.、Um, actually, there are some bad news about the city on the internet. So、yeah. the biggest expectation I have is that、uh, I don't expect people. To have bad impression of the、uh, Wuhan, the city, because it it's always been a very nice city, and it has over three thousand five hundred history. Oh, so you're saying that? And it's also a city good to live in. Yeah, so it's still a good city. It's just a temporary difficult situation. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh. What can you share? What else can you share? You said this well.、Uh, huh? Is that about our own lives?、Mm-hmm. After this virus, we are we know that life is is gentle and mild and fragile. Yes. So the best thing I learn from this virus is we should cherish every moment in your life. Yeah.、Mm, copy them. Yeah, carpe diem, right? Well, oh yeah. Or you can't overemphasize、yes. that. Before the people- virus, we 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 just do what we do every day, and we are expecting maybe one year later,、uh, five years later, what we are going to do. We、uh-huh. are worried about what we can do and what we can't do. But now, we just want to be healthy. Yeah, yeah. Puts things in perspective. Well, thank you so much, teacher. <laughs> Let's get back、oh. to the lesson. We've got three <laughs> minutes left in my lesson because I was late. Okay, I'm gonna stop.